today I was asked how to edit a bitmap image in flash and <laughs> I was a bit stumped so I have to get back to um, what is the student that asked me and this is I found a, a solution for him um, the lasso tool it will get you what you need okay so in class we tried to manipulate a ping version and a gif version so this is actually the the image that we used so I'm gonna stick with this uh, the first one is a gif and the second one is a ping you can see if it's up against the background it's transparent okay that you know the transparent background so anyway I'm gonna zoom out and I'm gonna use the quick transform the free transform just to scale it down to the same size as the other but you can see this one has a white background okay so I'm gonna zoom back in <coughs> and I'm gonna break it apart I'm just gonna hit command B it's broken apart and now I can use the lasso tool and once you click on the lasso tool there's a couple of items down here that come in so see when I'm on a different tool you don't see them but when I click on the lasso tool you get the magic wand tool and you get the magic wand settings and you get the uh, polygon mold mo mode okay so with the lasso tool once this item is broken apart I mean with the um, lasso tool I can just click on the magic wand and click on this item and boom I can delete the the image there so with this one as you can see if I move this over here onto the gray whoops <laughs> gray background you can see that I can remove this white background ah, and one thing I just wanted to add on there if I drag the the image in and Okay, I'm just going to scale it down the size so it'll fit on the screen here. If I break this apart, ah, sorry, using the wrong key commands. Uh, I was ungrouping that, and I'm going to break it apart. This is strange. All right, I think I've. All right. Um, one thing. Uh, one thing I forgot to mention is if I drag this in here and I break this item apart, uh, Command B, it, it it behaves just like any other item that's broken apart uh, in in Flash. So if I hover over the edge, you get that. You can see that little curved mark on the just below my my arrow. And if I just drag that in, it just sort of leaves the bitmap image intact and I can sort of cover it up you know cover bits and pieces of it okay so that's a another fun little thing that you can you can do with with uh, with a, the image and that's it quite simply Okay, and then and then I can just use the lasso tool to clean up what's these little extra lines that are that are left here, um, and I can click on the polygon tool here to select. You know, in that way, double click and it closes. And I, I you I don't know if you can see in the screen, but there is a line there, but now it's gone. And now we have little Bart Simpson, and he's the background has been removed the nice thing about this other than just using the straight PNG it actually I, I believe it actually has let takes up less memory because you don't have all these extra bits of empty space that are being carried around and then I just command G group that um, this uh, PNG file actually if I hit break apart it should work the same way I'm on the lasso tool hit the magic wand let's see magic wand and there's the background and I can delete all of that extra the extra space extra um, information back there um, the other nice thing about the bitmap say I mean with the magic wand is say if I click on on the figures face okay it, it will select I mean these are all uh, it's all yellow so it's selecting all this yellow in his face so I'm gonna click off and then I'm gonna click on the settings and I'm gonna drop that down to 10 and and you can adjust the smoothing and as well to go to pixels rough and normal but I'm just gonna leave it smooth and see now that it's down this the the tolerance it's actually the 
threshold is down to 10. Let's see if we can keep it. Yeah, and it stays in this very particular yellow color. It doesn't carry into the rest. Um, I can even, you know, hold the shift key down and select other areas and delete. So anyway, that's it. I hope this helps. Thanks. Bye.